Welcome back to that dad guy. Thanks for tuning in. So, uh, if you are a subscriber for my Instagram as well, you would have seen the post saying that I've reached 15,000 views and 150 subscribers on YouTube. So thank you so much to everyone out there who has subscribed, liked, comment, and uh, shared my videos with others. Uh, keep up the good work. We're at 152 subscribers as of today and the views keep mounting. So very pleased with uh, the way the channel has gone and all the support and encouragement that I'm getting. Um, if you did watch or hadn't watched, let me tell you about the last video that I did get put up was on Saturday of this week. And it was a golf video. It was my first time back on a course in 10 years. And somewhere between the 17th and 18th hole, my tripod fell off my bag and it wasn't recovered. So I ordered a new one. It's in now, so that's why I'm back to making a video. And with Post Crossing, I have two addresses that I'm able to send out letters to. So I thought I would just print those off. We'll pick a couple cards, I'll write them up, and we'll send them off. So probably not a long video, but uh, I'll get you to join me on this uh, little trip. So here we go. The first person I have the address for is Alina, and she's in Russia. Uh, she speaks English and Russian, and she likes drawing and reading. Uh, she loves to travel and learn new languages. She loves hockey. She's interested in law and she's studying to be a prosecutor. So way to go. She's a creative person and uh, she wants to hear about my cultures, hobbies. And uh, if I'm into hockey, she's into hockey. So yeah, I love hockey as a Canadian. It's uh, one of our two national sports. And if you didn't realize that we had two national sports, actually our first um, national sport is lacrosse, which is an Aboriginal game. And you probably have seen that. Uh, it's got a long stick and a net at the end and a very small goal and a really hard ball and you throw it and try to get it in the net with uh, that and you can catch. So that's lacrosse. If you haven't seen it, uh, Google it. That's uh, Canada's first national sport, even though everyone assumes it's hockey. And now hockey is our second national sport. So she says she likes cards that uh, about the place where I live, art, especially Vincent van Gogh. Uh, pink postcards, mountains, flowers, especially lavender, villages, moomin, I don't know what that is, <laughs> cute animals, breathtaking landscapes, Polaroid photos, Eurovision, and Hello Kitty. Well, I thought, I saw this one for uh, landscapes. Uh, interested in that one, could be that. If she likes flowers, we have cards like this. I don't have a lavender one, but I do have a bunch of different flowers. And what you think of these ones? This is blue, but not lavender, so I'm not sure of those. Art, I have that art card by Dante Rossetti. It's an oil on canvas. So that could be. Or how about this, Nova Scotia, some beautiful waves crashing. That could be in the landscaping, landscape. Or this one of Newfoundland and their icebergs. Hmm. I don't have any Hello Kitty. I don't have any Eurovision. I don't have any Polaroid, Polaroid photos. So I think it's gonna have to be one of these ones. And I'm thinking either the art, because she says she really likes art, even though that's not Van Gogh. That might be interesting. Or this, I don't have any hockey postcards. That would have been good, but. I think I'm gonna discount the flowers because it's not lavender. And when you think of Canada, do you really think of Desert, I know we have it, but it's not really what you first think of. You kind of think of ice and icebergs, but where she's in Russia, maybe the waves crashing instead, and it's pretty local to here. Hmm. I think though, I think I'm going to go with this one. Because I don't have too many that say they like art. So I think we're going to do this. Landscaping is a pretty basic one for many. So I'm going to put that aside before I fill it out. 
Now the next one I printed off, it's for uh, Svetlana and she lives in Germany, but she's originally from Russia and she loves Australia. Uh, she has a family with two children and then she talks about liking movies and Michael Jackson and the musicians that she likes and TV shows she likes. As for cards, she'd like to have movie cards with actors and actresses on them. She prefers modern films. Um, I don't have any cards like that. Uh, he collects cards with female characters. Well, the first one that popped to mind when she said female characters was the queen. We can't get all these different poses and her through the years. Um, she's been steadfast. So I have a postcard with the queen on it. And it stamps. And she says she collects uh, cards with coffee and tea time with berries and cakes. So I thought about this card. This is from the Kelly's Bake Shop in Alma, New Brunswick, which isn't very far from me. And uh, these are their world famous sticky buns. So it's actually every Father's Day here. It's my tradition. Uh, we take two kids and my wife and we head down to uh, Alma and we get some sticky buns and then we go into Fundy National Park and go for a hike or uh, a drive or whatever the weather might permit. But uh, when it comes to bakes and sticky buns, those are good starters. Um, she also collects stamps, preferably with women on them. So once again, this one here with the queen and all the stamps, that I think might be a good one. And she also likes cartoons. So how about we have these two ladies that are working on their computers, but they're actually just texting each other. So there's a cartoon. Or even a more basic cartoon with this bumblebee that looks like he has uh, forks for feet. Or maybe a Canadian cartoon. You've got two bears that are riding dolphins <laughs> holding Canadian flag balloons. Uh, so it's kind of silly. But I think, as much as I would like to promote local, she says she collects stamps and she likes... In multiple times, she said she's liked female characters, either in actresses or uh, in pictures. So I think this beautiful card of the Queen in stamp form is going to be the one we're going to send off to Svetlana in Germany. So let me put aside the other cards that we won't need at this point. And then we'll reposition the camera so you don't see the address. And then we'll uh, set this up. Well, here you can see I've got my cards written and filled out. I don't tend to show you too much of what I write um, because uh, that's I guess, private for whoever's going to be receiving the card. And they want to have a surprise too because maybe they watch this and they say, hey, that card's coming to me. Well, I don't want to tell them ahead of time uh, what they're going to get or what they're going to see, I guess. But. So now we're just going to go out here, we're going to walk down to the mailbox and we're going to put them in the mailbox before uh, the postman comes to pick up the mail for the day. So here we go, you can see here, here's the mailbox, here's my cards and they're heading out. Now that those cards have been mailed out, I want to remind you that I'm still collecting pictures of uh, mailboxes and post offices from around the world. I've now got 13 countries that have submitted, but uh, still looking for more. Missing major countries like Germany, China, um, Portugal, France, those are some European. I don't have anything from South America. I don't have anything from African countries. I have one from the United Arab Emirates, but other than that, I don't have anything in the Middle East. I do have Australia, but don't have anything from New Zealand um, or some of like Thailand or Taiwan. There's all sorts of countries out there that uh, could submit. So if you are watching and you're from one of those countries, please go to uh, my Instagram, Rob Lennox, and send me a direct message. You can send me the pictures that way and then they'll be included in the video. But uh, the video is coming along nicely. I appreciate all the ones that have come in so far and I'm hoping that we'll get some more before I can top it off. I'd like to have at least 20 countries to be re represented before I publish the video. So let's get there. We're at 13 now. All right, stay safe. What follow? You say like, subscribe, share, and tell all your friends. Look at the boy. 
Who's a good boy?